So I will be going to Mexico for two weeks. Um, I'm going to Durango. That's in Mexico. We have everything packed already. I leave tomorrow. Today is Friday. I leave tomorrow, Saturday at 5 a.m. Hi guys, I haven't done a proper introduction. I got here yesterday. We were so tired. I didn't really want to vlog too much yesterday. I'm gonna get ready for the day. We're not sure what we're gonna do, but. We're walking to the store. Here's the little trail that you take to cross the road. So usually in Mexico I get really sleepy around like 2-3 um, so I normally take a lot of naps when I travel here to Mexico but I don't get bored here because it's like I don't know like it's hard to get bored here um, but at the same time there's like you don't really do much but it's just like calm, you know, like there's nothing really to worry about, I guess. So that's what I kind of like about here. This clown. shower and then this window connects to the kitchen which is kind of disturbing because if you're like taking a they could hear you so this is like I guess the living room you could call it um we don't really have much furniture yet but my mom has been decorating we wash the clothes this is where we hang them but yeah it's pretty much just like this um there's not much out here and then let me show you guys the kitchen okay this is the kitchen door there's two doors usually that one's for the flies the little fridge the stove the sink the table and this is where my grandma stores her food and then just like the little micro and then like um the waters um yeah, I'm just eating breakfast right now. Fun fact, according to my last memory, I have this area 
this is where my great grandma passed away. I clearly remember her dying in this house. Um, this house has been like knocked down already. No one really lives in it, only like the two people that roam around, but they're like, they're not really like well, I guess you can say. Um, but yeah, that's, I haven't gone in it since years, cause I could probably find someone there sleeping. <laughs> trips I've ever had to Durango um because I got to do a lot more this time um so you guys definitely saw how living 
in the rancho is compared to like going to the city and then going out to places um so definitely the rancho life is very humble life it's very calm i guess um the only bad part about it is there's like a lot of like um cheats me i guess you can say within the whole um community um but other than that i mean yeah it's very it's very beautiful state i'd say if you're looking for a place to travel i recommend going to durango especially the touristic sites they're very pretty um but yeah i definitely enjoyed it this time and you guys got to see the rancho versus the city life um most definitely i would have to say the rancho life just because i like the peacefulness and not so many people um durango is also a state with many culture many history so i definitely recommend um getting informed about the state more if you want to travel or you could just learn about it when you go um travel there in the touristic side but that place that state is um where they film a lot of movies i don't know if you guys seen um on the clip of my vlog where there's like a strip of like a film strip that's all the movies that have been filmed there in durango um but yeah it's surprising to see how a state like that could have so much history and so much culture um it's not always just the state of the alacranes which is what we're known for but there's also more to the state so but yeah i definitely enjoyed it i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did make sure to share this video give it a like and subscribe to my channel because i will be posting more videos of course i will see you guys next time goodbye